Anderson County Board of Commissioners recently voted on a $52 million plan to rebuild Hendersonville High School. They're putting the entire project on a three to five acre strip of land. It's safe to say Mayor Kerry O'Kane, a Henderson High grad, isn't happy about it. So he proposed a new plan Wednesday that he says will save taxpayers millions of dollars. Our proposal is $46 million. The county's plan doesn't incorporate the current school's building, which O'Kane says is iconic to the city. They have not funded anything for the restoration of the existing Stillwell building. The Steelwell building in front of Hendersonville High School is 90 years old, and Mr. O'Kane tells me it's a matter of saving tradition. I feel like it could easily at last another 90 years. O'Kane also says the new school's location in a nearby lot is unsafe. The classroom buildings will be within 30 to 50 feet of U.S. Highway 25. His proposal to renovate the historic Steelwell building got a standing ovation from the audience. <laughs> But Henderson County Capital Budget Manager David Barry says O'Kane's $46 million budget is unrealistic. Can you build something cheaper? Absolutely. Will it be what everyone wants or what is needed? I don't think so. Brenda McDavid, WYFF News 4 in Hendersonville. After six hours of discussion, the Board of Commissioners decided to stay with its plan to rebuild Hendersonville High School. The plan does not include portable classrooms. That historic Stillwell building will remain intact, but will not be a part of the new main campus.